Hey everybody, it's Daniel from the blog It's Like Have My Own Card Shop. Hope everybody's day is going well. Uh, appreciate all the comments on my video yesterday for my 500 Home Run Club bat card collection. Um, today, I uh, made a purchase at uh, my LCS and I uh, want to give a little bit of background on this. Um, so when I was a kid, um, you know, I started collecting in uh, 1988, and so uh, mostly was just buying packs of 88, and then 89, 90, just, you know, newer stuff, current stuff. Um, but one year, it must have been for my birthday when I had gotten some cash, um, I'd gone to the card shop and uh, actually purchased what, uh, for me, was... Uh, vintage and um, you know they, these were just two really uh, big cards in my mind um, and that's these two cards so I had to get a you know a special case if you remember you know back in the early 90s these were pretty top of the line for cards well these two cards that I picked up uh, I probably spent I don't know, 15 or $20 picking these two up, and uh, that was huge money at the time for me as a, you know, whatever I was, 9, 10, 11 year old, um, and uh, I mean, these were uh, Hank Aaron cards from when he played. Now, um, this, you know, this one here I think is his actually his last card. Um, and this one is just a uh, record breaker card, but again, for me, um, th it was huge. It was huge pickup. So I think that's kind of where it started with Hank Aaron. Um, just over the years, I've always liked Hank Aaron, and um, this past couple of years, um, I found some nice. Uh, in my opinion, nice. So uh, when I when I say that, I mean um, his cards are nice in my opinion, and uh, with the condition, the price is nice as well. So um, I've been able to pick up uh, some some older Aaron cards. I've had this one for a while. I got this one kind of uh, you know as a kid, but uh, it's got like a stain over here on it. Um, but I've had that one for a long time, so it was those first two, then that one, and then within the last couple of years, I've picked up just a few here and there. Some of them I've been able to find, um, like these uh, League Leader cards. Um, I've been able to find for like two dollars, um, stuff like that. Um, pick this one up. I love the way the vintage looks in the magnetics, um, just the, the old and the new combined, I guess. Um, really like that card, 61. Um, Got to get a magnetic for this one, but I think this is a 73. And then um, just recently I had picked up this one, this Fence Busters, and again it's beat up, but the price was right, and it's a, a vintage Hank Aaron, and, and you got Eddie Matthews there as well. So there's a, a card at my LCS that I've been looking at for a while, and I just pulled the trigger today. Um, so never thought I would own it, but here it is. Nineteen fifty four tops Hank Aaron rookie card. You can see very off centered, uh, definitely well loved. I'll say that well loved, and I will continue to love this card. Um, I feel like I got a, a good deal on it. Um, 
and uh, definitely uh, motivated to continue to get more Hank Aaron cards. So, um, really excited uh, to own this this card. So, all right. Thanks, and have a great day. Bye.